So um, I am Teresa and I am the founder of Au Revoir Les Filles and today I'm actually going to show you um, a stacking tutorial on how you can transform a very simple outfit into something that's more polished with jewellery. Uh, so before we start, I'm just going to wait for a few more minutes like you know, for people to join us and I just wanted to say hi Kayla, thank you so much for joining. And I think that is Mei Ting as well. So, oh, all my friends are coming. And, um, you know, thank you so much for supporting me here. Let me see, I think I just... <laughs> How's everyone doing in lockdown currently? Well, I hope um, you're doing well. Um, it's a really nice Saturday today here in Sydney. So um, uh, it would be really nice to go to the beach, but currently um, I don't think the beach is like within five kilometers of me. So I probably will go to a park, you know, and take my um, dog out later after this. But I'm so glad that you guys are able to join me. And, you know, it's a great chance. Um, you know, I just want to say hi. It's been so long and I really miss everyone. I haven't got a chance to do like markets um, because of the restrictions. So I'm hoping those will actually start soon but anyway I'm really excited to um, you know have you guys join me for Instagram live so let's get started okay so currently I am in lockdown in Sydney and I have been for the past three months and with lockdown I am finding that my style has become a lot simpler so um, because I'm not going out anywhere you know I really miss going out with my girlfriends I miss dressing up but dressing up during lockdown has felt too much so what I like to do is I like to use jewelry to transform my look from something that's very simple into something that's very polished in just a few seconds and the thing I like about jewelry is that it is really easy to wear. So if I'm rushing, like say for a Zoom meeting, um, you know, I'm in a rush and I don't have time to like change my top or my outfit, all I have to do is just to put on a couple of pieces of jewelry and my look can be transformed from something that's quite ordinary into something that's a lot more polished in just a few seconds. So today I'm going to show you the pieces that you need to transform your look. So these here, they are the pieces from the new collection, which is La Vie en Rose. Ah, La Vie en Girl, sorry. So these ones here, uh, they are made in stainless steel and they are plated in 18K gold. So what I love about 18K gold is that it's a really beautiful warm gold um, that matches any skin tone. So I've got quite tan skin. Uh, but and this gold looks really nice against my skin tone but it is a skin um, a gold that will actually look really good whether you're like fair or whether you're very dark skin it is something that actually matches everyone um, the thing I like about stainless steel is that um, it is um, tarnish free so if it gets wet you don't actually have to worry about it you know like getting dark and I've actually been testing these pieces for the last few months in lockdown um, you know so I've worn them in the shower I haven't taken them off and um, what I'm liking is that they still actually retain their brilliance and they don't tarnish which I know is something quite a few of you have, um, quite a few of you have actually mentioned to me in my markets like oh you are looking for something that's a little bit easier to take care of so something that is um, you know like tarnish free that you can wear in the shower so these ones um, I hope that you actually like these pieces and with my outfit today I've got something that's very simple so just a classic white shirt uh, and I've got on sweatpants so these are from Bonds so this is my favorite go-to um, work from home outfit uh, what I like about it is that it's very easy it is um, very comfortable and they are also pieces that I think you can find in any wardrobe so when you are experimenting with jewelry especially with like layering jewelry start with an outfit that's very simple uh, go for like classic silhouettes so like a white shirt or like a t-shirt um, a top that has like a v-neck to it uh, even just like a slip dress or like a lacy camisole and with colors stick to something that's very neutral I always like white um, I mean if you see me in my markets I'm always wearing like white or creams um, I do like um, blush colors as well and even um, neutrals like grey mal, navy and black they are really good because they really make jewelry pop against your skin when you have like the brilliance of gold or silver and you wear it against like a dark shirt um, the color just really stands out okay so i'm going to lay on my first piece which is the ursula chain so this here has got really 
geometric U-link chain. So I'm not sure if you can see that. Um, it has like little balls on the end. And what I like about this chain is how utilitarian it is. So it's a really good weight for a chunky chain. And when I'm going to wear it, I'm going to wear it all the way at the very end. So all our Ravale Fee jewelry comes with a generous um, necklace on the back. So I'm going to just put this on the very end. And you want it to sit just below your collarbone. So this is a really good length for any chunkier chain that you're wearing just because it's not too high like it doesn't look like it's like choking you and it's not too low and it's a good length that actually matches any top so look at how nicely that is catching the light and just with like one piece um, it already feels like I've put more thought into my outfit and it really starting to look a lot more polished I'm gonna finish up this look with um, some ear hoops so these are the detachable pole hoops. What I've done is I have actually taken off the pole and just worn it on its own. And what I like about it is that really nice twisted rope texture to it. So with ear hoops, they are a very timeless piece. And, but they're actually really trendy at the moment. So I'm not sure if you can see them. So what I like about it is that they are pieces that I can find 10 years from now in my jewelry box and it will still be something that I wear to this day. Um, a lot of the um, um, celebrities are wearing it as well and it's just something that's quite trendy but still classic, you know, that you need to have in your jewelry case. So look at how nicely that gold just matches against the gold on my neck. And think of jewelry like um, highlighter, you know? Like when you put on makeup, you want like, you know, you put a bit of like highlighter on your cheeks or on like planes of your face to catch the light. That's what jewelry does as well. So there's like a little bit of gold here, a little bit of gold there. And that just focuses the look onto my face and gives it a lot more um, detail and makes it look, look more polished. Okay, so if you are just interested in like a polished classic look, stick with like, you know, a chunkier necklace, stick with hoops. But if you want something that's a lot more um, stylish and fashionable, layer it up. So I am going to layer the Forbes necklace, which is also from the new collection La Vion Go. So this has a very minimal T-bar pendant here. And what I like is that it's very, very simple. It's something that you can just wear very easily on its own. So in terms of how I'm going to wear it, this is the extension chain. So it's really long. I'm going to wear it about halfway through the extension chain. But before you actually clasp it, so when I'm layering necklaces, what I like to do is before I actually clasp it, I'm just going to touch my fingers together on the back of my neck. And then this is a way for me to see how the necklace will sit before I actually clasp it up. So as you can see, that length looks good. So now I'm gonna go in and I'm gonna clasp it. And this is a trick that I learned because I have to put on so many necklaces sometimes. This is just a quick, simple trick that I use, you know, without having to like put on a necklace, realize that the length isn't right and then take it off and then put it on again and it just wastes quite a lot of time so this is like my little hack of just like putting it on the back of my neck seeing if the length is right then I put it on so there you go look at how nice and elegant that looks and what I like about this stack is that it is quite edgy um, it's actually quite rare to wear something that has like a narrow pendant on the top and then a chunkier chain on the bottom but i do like quite i really like the stack because i've actually worn it for quite a few zoom tutorials and i always get like comments on it so if you're after something that's a little bit edgier more fashionable this is a great stack to have and the best thing about this is you can actually buy this as a set so it comes as the four necklace deck, which is a set of two necklaces so rather than purchasing one necklace on its own this just comes as a set of two Okay, last but not least, I am going to show you how to do a glam stack. So I've got two necklaces on, I'm going to add on a third one. Okay, so this here, this is one of my absolute all-time favorite necklaces. It's the North Star necklace. It has a beautiful 
8 point star with really sparkling handset cubic zirconia. What I really love about this are the little triple bubble beads that's on the dainty chain. So I wear this so often. Okay, and when I am layering this, so as you can see, that's the extension chain. I'm probably gonna wear it a little bit longer, so probably a centimeter away from the edge of the extension chain. And I'm not gonna clasp it up first. I am actually going to put it on the back of my neck, have my fingers touch, look in the mirror, see if that's a good length. So that's looking like it's a good length. And then I'm gonna go in and I'm gonna clasp it. So when you are layering necklaces, don't be afraid to adjust them. So I'm going to just pop the chunkier chain on top of the star necklace so that it sits a little bit better. So I think that's looking really good. Um, what I'm finding is I might maybe take off this pendant because it's distracting away from the North Star necklace. So with the four pendant, you can actually just slip off the pendant. So that's the pendant right there. And you can actually just wear this on its own as a Figaro chain. So again, with this, I'm going to wear this probably like a little bit towards the end. And this will actually look really good because currently like, you know, with jewelry, you have that like double chain kind of look. So when you're stacking necklaces, you do want it to have at least two to three centimeters between each stack. And when layering necklaces, go for necklaces with different chains. So I've got one that's more classic and sleek chain. I have a chunkier industrial chain and I have a dainty chain there. And this actually adds interest to your stack. It makes it look more unique and it also makes it look a lot more effortless. And last but not least, go with necklaces that have different lengths. So I've got one that's a little bit shorter. I have got one that's uh, more like a medium length. And then I've got one that has um, a longer length. And um, you don't actually need a lot of jewelry. So all you need are like, you know, two to three pieces and you can actually create lots of different looks from them. So any one of these necklaces I can wear on its own, or I might even just like, you know, wear the chunky chain with like the star necklace, or I could actually just wear like, you know, the slimmer chain with the chunkier necklace. So there you go. So I hope like, you know, you find that beneficial. And just remember with stacking jewelry, you don't, like if you're not feeling comfortable, you can just take one piece off. And that's the whole beauty about jewelry is that it is so versatile. It is something that you can take off or put on straight away. And if it doesn't feel right, just take one piece off. You have to feel comfortable when you're wearing jewelry because when you actually feel good, then that's when you know that, you know, um, the stack is actually looking good. Um, and also focus on quality. So all Aurora Lefi jewelry, they are plated in gold and they are designed for stacking. So you can actually create lots of very interesting combinations with just a few necklaces. Uh, yeah, thank you so much for joining me. And I'm so glad to be able to connect with you during lockdown. Uh, if you have any questions, you know, please uh, leave me a comment. And if there's any more um, like tips you would like with regards to stacking or maybe any um, outfits that you would want me to like stack them with, let me know and I would love to do more stacking tutorials for you. Um, and last but not least, um, you know, I hope everyone has a really nice Saturday. Um, I hope to be able to see you soon after lockdown. And again, thank you so much for joining me. Um, you know, it's been so nice having you. Have a good day, guys. Mwah. Okay, how do I turn this off? Let me see.